welcome to Unbox Talk, the show where we unbox it, then talk about it. I'm Jacob, and today we're going to be looking at the SERP Genie 2 Linear Head. Uh, we did get a demo of this product when we attended NAB, and it was really cool, uh, and it works with any slider, but it also works really well with some of their other products, which we'll probably be doing other Unbox Talk videos on, so check those out. But uh, let's get into it. So this is a very interesting package. I don't think I've seen any other company do a box like this. It's all cardboard, but really like high quality, thick, good cardboard. It's a box that would last quite a long time. Uh, I'm gonna break the seal, get us into it. Or at least attempt to. So lesson number one, even if you don't think uh, you need scissors or a sharp object for an unboxing video, you should bring them. My opinion on this box has completely changed. I kind of hate it. All right, I got it. It took a little bit of finagling, but here we go. Oops. There we go. So here we have, it's interesting, like everything's built into the cardboard itself. So we have our quick release plate. We have the uh, main actual head itself. Uh, very interesting looking. We have a USB-C port on the side. You have a small little joystick for control with an additional button. Uh, it does look like there's a clasp here on the side which opens up and it reveals a external battery which I believe you're supposed to take the uh, plastic protecting the contacts off of. That's a pretty beefy battery. Uh, I believe the outer package, without dumping everything, says it's a 2600 milliamp battery. That's pretty good. So there's a standard uh, mount at the bottom. Next we have, oh, that's so kind of ingenious. Uh, this is your instruction manual, and it is circular. <laughs> Not very many of those around. Uh, so it goes through all the pages. It very much has like a recycled paper feel. I don't know if it is or not, but it looks cool. Uh, also with that is a warranty slip. And then uh, hidden in the bottom of the compartment is all the junk, all the extra stuff. So we have a SERP branded microfiber cloth. Uh, I don't think you'd need that for this itself. I think it's just a little bonus they threw in. We have a USB-C cable. These are always handy and uh, this can use it for charging or connecting to some of the other pieces uh, that they sell. We have wow, an incredibly short European style power adapter. Oh, these are all the same length. Uh, here's the American one. Uh, that is I don't think I've ever seen a power adapter that short. It's kind of comically short. Oh, let's see. There's gonna be other ones. Yes, okay. So here's the uh, UK one. Same exact length. And I think that's all. So next up in the container, we have the uh, brick that you plug the power cable into, which just turns it to USB-C. I don't know why you wouldn't just make that like one piece. I don't know. Oh, here's the last one. This is a uh, Japanese, uh, Asian style, I think. Uh, 
Next we have your rope, which is uh, used for the device to move along by pulling itself. Uh, it's a very strong, like, nylon braided material. That's not going to fray on you anytime soon. That's really nice. Uh, then we have your uh, straps. Those are neat. I think they, uh, yes. they mount to the side of the device itself. That's pretty cool. Then we have a bunch of little things in the bottom of the container. It's kind of worrying because like it would be really easy to lose any of these. So we have some adapters for different mounting plate sizes. Speaking of losing them, I'll find that later. Uh, then we have a USB-C to USB-A adapter. I'm not sure what you'd use that for, to be honest, but I'm sure we'll figure that out. And that's everything. That is everything in the box. It's empty, but you can keep the box. It's a good storage container, I suppose, but not the greatest. Well, anyways, uh, now that we have unboxed it, let's talk about it. SERP is based in the UK. Its stated goal as a company is to provide excellent equipment to independent filmmakers. The SERP Genie 2 Linear accomplishes this by providing a cost-effective, scalable drive system for camera sliders that can be controlled either from the device itself or with a mobile device. The SERP Genie 2 Linear is able to work with any slider because of its cleverly designed rope system. The Genie 2 app for mobile devices allows users to program the speed and length of linear movements and is designed to work together with the Genie 2 pan tilt head. The unit itself is powered by a 2600 milliamp battery and can be easily charged in 3 hours with a USB-C connector. It can hold up to 11 pounds and the drive is able to pull up to 16 pounds of force. The SERP Genie 2 Linear weighs in at only 2 pounds, but it's built to close tolerances and made of strong materials. When using it with the comparatively heavy Genie 2 Pan Tilt, the stresses and leverages are increased so it's important to make sure your rails are secured and properly balanced. Looking at the SERP Genie 2 Linear, you'll see the Quick Release button, Quick Release Lock, Linear Base, camera port, which is a 2.5mm jack, capstan drive gear, capstan release button, USB-C port, camera record light, charging light, wireless connection light, joystick, power button, and a tightening wheel. The SERP Genie 2 Linear runs about $8.99 in the US. In the package you'll find the Genie 2 Linear and Battery Plus QR plate, capstan, quarter inch to 3 8 inch adapter, quarter inch camera screw, rope hooks, charger, USB-C charge cable, USB adapter, and international plugs. The SERP 2 Genie Linear works surprisingly well given the simplicity of its design. The rope system allows it to work with any slider while still keeping setup simple. The drive motor has plenty of power and the mounting system fastens cameras or heads securely and easily. The motion is very smooth and movements can be controlled precisely. We use our Genie 2 Linear regularly and have had much more success with it than similar devices in this price range from other manufacturers. That's all we have for this uh, Unbox Talk, but make sure you check out some of our other Unbox Talk videos. There's going to be a playlist on screen. Uh, click that and you can see some of our other awesome equipment. And uh, see you guys next time.